What's going on? It's your boy Thorough Alexander, aka the Grand Architect, and today I'm gonna show you a few reasons why you should visit Yellowstone Park. And if you like what you see, don't forget to like and subscribe. So the first reason I would visit Yellowstone Park is definitely for the bison. Yellowstone Park is known for a lot of different wildlife, wolves, bears elk but one of the things that you'll definitely see very prevalent throughout the park is bison i mean they're just everywhere also if you're wondering where's the best place to spot bison the lamar valley is your best bet So the second reason I would visit Yellowstone Park is for its waterfalls. Yellowstone Park has over 45 named waterfalls and I actually did some research and come to find out Yellowstone Park actually has over 100 waterfalls but these are just a few of the ones that I was able to check out. This waterfall right here wasn't even on a map, but we saw it on the way to Mammoth Springs and decided to pull over and check it out. Reason number three, Mammoth Springs. Now this is one of the most colorful features of the park. When most people think of the colorful features of Yellowstone, they automatically think about Grand Prismatic, but this is definitely one of the most colorful features in the entire park. Reason number four, Grand Prismatic. So many people come to visit this park just for this spot alone. And there are actually a few ways that you can view this beautiful hot spring. You can take the hike, which will take you up to an overlook that will give you this view, or you can take the boardwalk below. Also in the park are several other hot springs that you, that you can check out, like Black Pool right here. I mean, it's just one of the most beautiful hot springs I've ever seen. Kind of looks like a swimming pool. This one right here kind of gave me some sci-fi vibes. What do you guys think? You'll find this hot spring in the parking lot for the Grand Prismatic Trailhead. Reason number five, Old Faithful. And you don't have to worry about missing it erupting because in the parking lot, there's a billboard that has the time of each eruption. This might be the most famous geyser in the entire park, but believe it or not, it isn't even the tallest geyser. There are other geysers in the park, and there are two that are actually not too far from this particular geyser. And if you grab a park map, the map itself will show you where the other geysers are located. Reason number six, the views. Right here, this is the first view I actually saw when I went to Yellowstone that day on my trip. And these are the rapids. I was able to catch the ducks having breakfast. That was pretty cool. Here is also the Grand Canyon of Yellowstone Park. I mean, the view here is just amazing. This is the back of Gibbons Falls. So as I was at Gibbons Falls, I turned around and behold, voila. 
Hopefully you enjoyed my video and don't forget to like and subscribe. It's your boy Thorough Alexander signing out. Peace.